Welcome to Pedals and Stuff. I'm Sam and thank you for joining me. I think this is the best delay and reverb pedal that is out there at the moment. Please post your ideas down below because I know you're all going to have your own favourites as well. Things like the Keeley Caverns, for example, is absolutely amazing, but I think this is better. So right away, let's take a listen to this. I've put together a short piece we're using lots of different reverbs and delays on each track so you can kind of hear all the differences. But then after that, I just play a really quick clip so you can hear all of those parts in isolation so you can really get a good idea of the sounds that are on offer. And then if you wanna hang around after that, I'll go on and explain a few more of the features and, and basically why I think it's, it's just such, such a good pedal. Right, let's take a listen. All right, so everything I used in the short piece was using reverb and delays from this. So what I'm gonna do now is just kind of play you those really quickly separately so you can kind of hear the different sounds that I used in that video. Obviously there's a plethora of different sounds you can create from this, but here are a few that I use to give you a flavor of what's available. This is the Source Audio Collider, and it is basically a combination of their award-winning Ventris and Nemesis pedals. Now the Ventris and Nemesis are their dual engine reverb and delay pedals. And with this one, we again have a dual engine pedal, but this one has delay and reverb all in it. Now what's amazing about that is we can have just about all the sounds you can think of in one box. So reverbs, we've got room, hall, true spring, plate, shimmer, e-dome, which is like a big ethereal sound, and swell. On the delay side of things, we've got oil can, reverse, tape, analog, and digital. So you can see you've got just about all the engines you would want in there, and we can use them together in conjunction. Normally, we go from um, delay into reverb, but we can also have those both run in parallel, which is absolutely an awesome option. On top of that, we've got up to 128 presets via MIDI and it is fully MIDI compatible with a MIDI in and MIDI through. And it's also stereo ins and stereo outs. And it's got an expression pedal functionality too. It's just got everything you need. An editor, if you want to deep dive a little bit, absolutely brilliant. Um, 
It's got a switch for our typical favorite delay times, things like a dotted eighth or you know your crotchet or triplets. So it's got loads of lovely things like that in it. But where I think its main strength lies is a it's in the dual engine operation, right? Because we can have, as I said, reverb and delay but we can also have dual reverb or dual delay saved per preset. Now that is amazing in my opinion. Tap tempo and it's also got a hold function for the reverb. The sounds are absolutely fantastic. The box is sturdy and strong, brushed aluminium. It runs off nine volt power, um, 300 milliamps. So, you know, takes quite a bit to power it, but nothing exceptional it's brilliant all right thank you for watching please like and subscribe and please post down below your comments have you used this what do you think about it what is your favorite delay and reverb pedal in one box mind you okay <laughs> i know we've got a million other combinations but what about your favorite in one box see you soon